happening. Yeah, it is a chilly start. So if you're leaving right now, grab a light jacket stepping out the door. Yesterday shaped up to be a really fantastic day. Our highs topped out in the upper 60s to lower 70s, so it felt nice. We saw plenty of sunshine to the later half of the day. So really, Thursday, overall not that bad. And I think our temperatures today are going to begin to increase. Yesterday we topped out in the upper 60s at 67, 63 in Kokomo. Upper 50s to near 60 in South Bend yesterday afternoon. We're starting off anywhere between 5 to maybe a few spots 10 degrees cooler than this time yesterday morning. Here in Indianapolis, we're 6 degrees cooler, 8 degrees cooler up in Lafayette. So it is slightly chilly for those that are leaving and heading into work very early on this morning. Everybody waking up mainly in the 40s. 47 degrees in Indianapolis right now, 47 in Kokomo, 48 degrees in Columbus, 45 in Madison. So everyone feeling that chill on our Friday morning here, but everybody dry. So we're not tracking any precipitation. So really all you'll need stepping out the door, sunglasses, and then also a jacket. Keep that with you through the entire day today. Rain well east of us here. We are not imp at least expecting any rain chances through the day today. So a lot of our daytime hours underneath a blue sky. Plenty of sunshine as we head through the morning, through the rest of the afternoon, too. We're not tracking a whole lot, but we do have a cold front that will eventually arrive in the state late tonight and through early tomorrow. Now, this is going to generate the chance of a shower very, very late this evening, so a bit closer to midnight when a lot of us are heading home from any plants that we had later on this evening. That's when we have that stray shower chance, especially in northern Indiana. Temperatures today topping out in the low 70s. It's going to feel and look fantastic. 68 degrees by noon. By 5, we'll be at 70. Calm winds out of the south at 10 miles per hour. That's providing us with slightly warmer air. And all we'll see is sunny skies pretty much from start to finish. Daytime highs pretty much across the entire state, mid to upper 70s. A little cooler here in the city at 72, 74 in Bloomington, 75 north of us in Kokomo, 74 up in South Bend, upper 70s in Chicago. Any plans to head out to Friday night football tonight will be completely dry. I would grab a light jacket just to keep yourself uh, on the warmer side. Temperatures will dip into the mid-60s by the end of the game. Should be mainly clear, though. Temperatures then tonight will continue to cool into the middle 50s. So a little warmer than what we're anticipating heading into uh, early this morning is what we see early tomorrow morning. And then a cold Friends going to generate those light showers that we see by around 7, 8 o'clock tomorrow morning. So if you have any early morning plans, just be aware you'll probably be contending with a few scattered showers. By around 1 o'clock, we're going to kick out any of the shower chances, still keep around a little bit of cloud cover, and then we'll gradually decrease cloud cover as we head through the day tomorrow. So it does get a little bit better as we get deeper into your afternoon with highs in the upper 60s to lower 70s. Overall, your weekend forecast does not look awful. We'll have a few morning showers, mostly cloudy sky, approaching 70 and then mid 70s for Sunday afternoon. We also have the Colts forecast down in Nashville. Temperatures in the upper 70s to near 80 by 1. We should be at 80 at 3 o'clock, 5 o'clock, 79 degrees. After that, temps are going to continue to warm. We should be in the low 80s. And it looks like through the end of the month and early October, our temperatures are going to start to trend a little warmer here. And in our Peterman Brothers heating and cooling extended forecast, we see three days in the 80s next week. Monday, 81, 80. 83 Tuesday, but it looks like we see a very nice long dry stretch out ahead of us with fairly comfortable temperatures through the end of next week. Partly to mostly sunny skies right now. Thursday